Hi guys, in this video we are going to see how we can implement bot material view bottom navigation bar inside Flutter application. So when I click on different I icons, you can see that the I see that the content is also changed and icon is also changed. The selected icons and unselected icons are different, like this. When I click on home, home icon is different, and when I click on email, home icon changes. So let's see how we can implement this. So I have created a state bottom nav stateful widget. Inside this, I have created a list of widget for our content on the main screen. And using the void add function, I have added the widget inside my list that is content list. So these are my widget which I want to render when the user switches to different screen. I have created a selected index value uh, that will help me to change the indicator color or indicator in the bottom navigation bar. So now we are ready to go forward. So inside the scaffold, I will override bottom navigation bar and then I will provide navigation bar. After this, it requires destination. So I will provide the destination. So it will be navigation destination. And inside this, it requires icon. So I will provide icon and then it requires label. So label should be of a string. So now I will provide all four navigation destination for our app. So now our material view bottom navigation bar is ready. So now when I click on different icon, you can see that we are unable to switch to different screens. Inside the navigation bar, I will first use selected index and then pass this selected index value. And after this, I will override on destinations selected and then it will provide me index of the current selected uh, menu. And then using this, I will use call the set state. And inside this, I will update the selected index equal to index. And when I and now when I click on email, you can see that we are uh, able to switch to different screens. And here you can also see the changes as well. So now another thing you can do with this that uh, when the navigation, when the item is selected, you can show the different icon or when the item is not selected, you can show the different icon. So to do this, what we what we need to do is to override the selected icon. Uh, variable and then provide the icon when the menu is selected so now when i switch to different screen you can see that our home is now changed and when i click on home and then home icon is changed so same we will do with others so now when i switch to different screen you can see that the icon is also changing so in this way you can change icon uh, when the uh, when the menu is selected or when the menu is not selected you can change the icon as well so now one thing you uh, you can also do with this that you can change the height of the bottom navigation bar and you can provide your height as well so now you can see that our bottom navigation bar is now smaller and you can also change the background color so background color of the navigation bar you can be changed using background color and uh, and also you can change the indicator color and the uh, style of the label. So to do this, what you have to do is to wrap this navigation bar inside a widget. And then this widget should be of a navigation bar theme and then provide the data and the data should be navigation bar theme data. And inside this, we will provide the indicator color. So color should be our colors dot red now you can see that our indicator color is now changed uh, you can also provide the change the style of this uh, title so to do this override the label text style and then provide the and then provide material state property dot all and after this inside this you can pass the text style property and now you can change the size of the font size of the title so you can see that the our title is now bigger and another thing you can do you can also add properties another properties to the uh, label that you can show the label when it is selected so to do this you need you have to come inside navigation bar and then override label behavior and it should be navigation bar destination navigation destination label behavior dot only only show selected so when i save it it will only show the label to the menu that is selected you can also al always hide this so i will currently show always so so in this way you can implement material your bottom navigation bar inside flutter application so thanks for watching